Right, so Caleb has been loving reading books and he loves musical books that have sounds or books that have texture on them and I find this is also a great activity for car journeys too. The second activity he's really been enjoying is making slime. We make our own slime by literally mixing corn flour and water. This makes a really cool mixture that is sort of a solid but also a liquid. It's really easy to make and there's no nasty chemicals in it. And this is something that my four-year-old also loves to play with. And you can add food coloring or scents to it to make it even more interesting. Now, obviously, this activity is a little bit more messy, but it's so worth it because it keeps my kids busy for a long time. The next one might seem obvious, but sometimes you're so tired, you just need reminding of things to do. So we love to get out in the fresh air, rain or shine, and go to the park. And now the kid's one and he's walking and even trying to run. He's really enjoying it and he's loving going on swings and using the slides and the sand pit and most toys that are in a park now. Okay, down the slide. Caleb is now loving games, simple games like catch or kicking a ball between us. He really seems to enjoy it and it's just so cute and so simple. I don't know if the next one is a boy thing or not, but my boys just love anything that have wheels, any car, pram, anything like that. They love just throwing them between each other and with me as well. And we got Caleb this car garage for Christmas, which he plays with endlessly. It must be his favorite toy. Right, the next one is water play. Caleb loves water play and because obviously it's winter at the moment, we've just been using our sink or our bath to play with water. But obviously in the summer months, we would be out in the paddling pool and have a hose and he would love that as well. This is just such a great activity and I find that it's really good on days when he's having a bad day teething and he needs to take his mind off of it. If I put him in the bath or the sink and play with some toys, it just keeps him happy for a little while and um, yeah, he just loves sticking his face under the water and splashing around. Right, the next one is something I spoke about in my first video. Caleb still loves his foil blanket. This is basically something that you would buy if you were like a marathon runner, you know, to keep you warm at the end of the race, but they only cost one pound on Amazon and Caleb loves them. They have really, really crinkly noise. So if you have a baby that loves to play with like crisp packets, this is exactly what you should get for them. Um, he also loves playing peepo with it, as you can see here. And um, yeah, it's just a really simple activity and it's just a little bit different. Right, now that Caleb is getting older, he's been doing some mark making on this easel that we got him for Christmas. It's from Ikea and we found that it's really the only way that he'll do some drawing. If you gave him crayons or markers at this age, he just eats them. Um, so this is the best thing and he enjoys it. He thinks it's really funny and he gets really proud of himself. So um, yeah, he likes to draw now as well. Right, the next activity you might not think is a good idea, but I love this kind of thing. Caleb really enjoys bashing on the pots and pans that we have and playing with our kitchen utensils. This keeps him busy for ages if I'm trying to do something in the kitchen. He really enjoys trying to get the lids back on the right pots 
and see how it all fits and works and the noise it makes. It's like his very own drum kit and it's all shiny and exciting. So he loves bashing on pat pots and that. He loves bashing on pots and pans and um, it's just so much fun. And he also loves the camera, as you can see here. I don't know if you'll think that the next one is a good idea either, but my boys love to make a soft play with our cushions and I'm really not that precious about our sofas. So I just let them pull off all the cushions on the couch and let the kids go crazy on it. And obviously I just sit by closely and watch them so that there's no injuries and I keep saying, careful, careful, but they really enjoy it. And if we can't make it out to a soft play, this is a great option watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope that some of these ideas were useful please like and subscribe for more videos like this and some other parenting ones and beauty ones and foodie ones and i will see you all soon thank you